Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are going to take a look at very practical topic that is to send a messages to your mobile whenever something gets changed into a SharePoint. So consider an example where you are managing your services, request your product servicing in a SharePoint list and you are a customer facing company organization. So whenever something gets changed to your service, you would like to send a push notifications or the SMSs to your customer's mobile number and as well as the WhatsApp messages. So here I'll be taking uh, help of one of the third party uh, connector or the provider I would say that is Tintech. So I'll be showing you how you can manage your service request within a SharePoint list and whenever something gets changed to your the SharePoint list service uh, requirements then it should push the SMS or a text message to your customer's mobile number so that the customer can be uh, keep updated with the status. So you can see I have created one of the service tracking lists. So this is basically an example where I'm a a service provider where I provide services for my uh, laptop, mobile, camera, all these repairing and I would like to keep my customers updated with the latest what is going on with their service requirements. So over here I have this service name, customer, customer phone number and status. So this is a pretty simple list and using this list I am going to send us text messages based on this list data. And as I said, I'll be using one of the existing third party, this Tintech.com. If you go to the dashboard, you would find that they provide various services uh, for the communication, sending SMSs, there's WhatsApps, and uh, and as well as they provide the APIs uh, where like if you directly want to work or send messages using their API. So right now I'm just using their free trial version and that supports sending messages and uh, uh, reading out, uh, checking the messages status. So if I just go to my Power Automate, because we to tie up this service to our SharePoint list, I will be using Power Automate. So if you, I can go to my flows and create one instant flow so that I can give you the demo how it works. So. The trigger I would be choosing when item is created or modified and I'll be binding that to my SharePoint list. So it's not like uh, you have to manage the your service data into SharePoint list. You can have other sources as well. Probably like if you would like to manage your data into data words tables then you can do that too and the same triggers would apply. The same uh, steps would be there to connect with the tin tech. So I'm just going to get my service tracking list and on a new step I'll be finding this tin tech and you can see like I have this tin tech 2 FA I can uh, check go for the actions that is related to two-factor authentications tin tech whatsapp tin tech sms messages and Viber business so probably like uh, for this example because I got this on the free trial created and it's very simple to create the free trial is just you need to sign up with your email ID and enter your first name username and that's it like with the default with the free trial they just give you uh, one API to work with so if I just go to my API settings you would see like I by default I get this trial API and if you click on show API key, you would get that API key where uh, that key we are going to use while tying up uh, this action in our this thing flow power automate. So when you click on this Tintech SMS business, so it will because you must be doing that for first time. So it should pop up you the connection. So let me show you that screen. So it will ask this thing. So you can just name your connection. And the API key you can just get your API key from here so you may try the free trial version of it but I found it very interesting so probably I am going to buy that for my organization because I got that requirement where I have to send the some SMSs so I'm going to propose this for my company and uh, this there, there's a 
provision of sending the whatsapp messages as well but uh, this would come up with the first payment so this whatsapp subscription is a paid one but the sms is one is a free so for this demo i am just using this free version so once you enter this connection name and api key it will just set up that connection and as i choose this uh, send a custom sms message so you can tie up these field two is the receiver's phone number so you can just tie the app that to your customer phone and from your phone number you can just mention your phone number over here so i'm just mentioning mine and text message you can just uh, fill up your text message dear and the customer name and below that you will be just sharing the status of service your service this service name status change to so you can just pick the status value so this is how like you can keep uh, your customer informed about what is being changed into your uh, service tracking list so once i save it okay so from address is mandatory i need to fill that up so i'm just uh, blurring that because i don't wish you to see my phone number So I have saved this and now I am going to create one text test item. So let's say Dell laptop repair request. Customer, let's say Jeff phone. I can put the phone number where I would like to have this notification. status has been changed to let's say fixed so i'll just save it and wait for my this uh, flow to run so my flow ran and it executed that all the steps successfully so i should get one notification and i'm just looking at my phone i got that message so i'll just uh, record whatever i see on my phone so that I can just have that uh, linked up with this video. So I'm just recording my screen. So I think that's it for today. I hopefully you like this video and probably it's a practical one. So you may try want, uh, using this feature uh, which will enable you to send your messages to your customers and keep them updated. So that's it for today. Thank you so much. If you like the video, please do subscribe and drop your comments. Thank you.